much better. Now she can just get some rest. I think we'll be all right. Okay. i tell you what, I'm going to have a cup of coffee. How about you? Uh, I should get back to my oh, station. Oh, come on. For crying out loud, I'll buy. Let me see now. It's uh, cream and sugar, right? Uh, no, it's not. It's cream no sugar, right? Right. Okay. What time are you getting off duty? 2.30. 2.30. Okay, I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna stick around here until Mrs. Clark passes the crisis stage, all right? Mm-hmm. Who's relieving you? Karen Billings. Oh, okay. You gonna ask me all about Stenbeck's ball? Thank you. Yes, how is it? Fantastic. Should have seen a lot of VIPs there. Security all over the place. Trying to keep out the great unwashed. Quite a deal. Did you see Cricket there? Was your daughter there? Mm hmm. How does she manage that? A boy she recently met named Eric Hollister invited her. Hollister? Ah, how about that? Obviously, you didn't see her. Well, come on, Lila. There were a lot of people there. I did meet the Swedish ambassador, but I'm afraid I didn't see Cricket. Tell me something. Isn't she just a little bit young to be doing something like this? What, it's a dance, isn't it? What's wrong with that? Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. I tell you, you should have seen this now. Half these women jetting in from all over the world. And I tell you, half of them couldn't hold a candle to you. I mean that. <laughs> I should have seen my fiancé. She was the hit of the ball. I mean, a knockout. Yes, I've seen your fiancé. She's very beautiful. Thank you very much. Coffee, so I need support. it. Hi, Dr. Dixon, Lila. Hi, everybody. Hi. A whole bevy of beauties working here tonight, eh? <laughs> Listen, flattery will get you everywhere. Watch out, he might take you up on that. Wait a minute. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. <laughs>